What happens during and after a colonoscopy? A colonoscopy is a medical procedure that lets your doctor look inside your colon and rectum for problems such as ulcers, inflammation, bleeding, polyps and tumours. A colonoscope is the tool used to perform a colonoscopy. It is a thin, flexible tube with a light and a video camera on the end. It is inserted through the anus into the rectum and is carefully guided up through the colon all the way to the small bowel, known as the terminal ileum. The colonoscope has a camera which sends images to the computer screen. It also has channels for spraying water and blowing air. There is also an instrument channel which allows special biopsy tools such as tiny forceps and wired loops to be passed to remove polyps and take samples of tissue. Colonoscopies take 30 to 60 minutes and are performed in a hospital or clinic by a trained doctor known as a gastroenterologist. You'll be offered a sedative to help you relax during a colonoscopy and you'll be placed on your side for the procedure. Your doctor can move the colonoscope around the curves of your colon and may also gently press on your abdomen during the procedure or ask you to change positions occasionally to help move the scope into your colon to help expand the passageway with air so that your doctor can see it better. Polyps are removed with the biopsy tools that get passed through the scope into the colon. The most common removal technique is called snare polypectomy. The polyps contain no nerves, so you won't feel pain during their removal. The colonoscope is then slowly pulled out while your doctor carefully examines the inside of your bowel. If your doctor finds polyps or suspicious areas during the colonoscopy, the polyps will be removed and small tissue samples will be taken to be checked for signs of cancer. Polyps are usually not cancerous, but they can change into cancer and that is why they need to be removed. After the colonoscopy, you'll be taken to rest in a recovery room until the effects of your sedation wear off. You may feel some gas, but this will quickly pass. You will need a family member or a close friend to drive you home, and you should take the rest of the day off and not make any major plans for 24 hours. Before you go home, your doctor will share the results of the colonoscopy with you if a biopsy was sent to the lab. It may, however, take a few days or longer to receive the results, depending on the number and size of the polyps found. Then, based on the quality of your bowel prep clean-out, your doctor will recommend when your next colonoscopy should be done. Colonoscopies are generally a safe procedure and complications are rare. If a polyp was removed or a biopsy was performed during your colonoscopy, there is a very small risk that you may have small amounts of blood in your stool for a few days afterwards. However, if you experience severe abdominal pain, fever, dizziness or continued heavy bleeding from your anus, please call your doctor right away.